Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Erin and today we're playing The Walking Dead Season 2. So I don't know if you can tell by my poor cosplay attempt, but I'm just as Clementine. I even tried to do like the little ribbons in her hair, but you know, I tried. I tried to capture her look because I am so excited to get into this game and play as Clem for the first time in Season 2. From here on out, I don't know anything that's gonna happen. Before we jump in though, I'd like to talk about my thoughts on Season 1 of the Walking Dead game. So last episode was probably the most traumatic <laughs> game I've played in a long, long time. I don't honestly remember the last time I cried that hard at a game. It was rough. And even knowing that Lee was going to die, it still did not make it any easier. If anything, it just made it harder because I knew it was coming. But before we talk about that, I want to talk about the rest of the episode and what went down. Basically, <laughs> when we were trying to find Clem, Lee ended up passing out because of his bite wound. He wasn't doing good. Obviously, we find out. It didn't make a difference. But I did go for chopping it off. I guess maybe the bite had just been on him for too long and, you know, whatever the walkers have gotten his bloodstream and... That was it. So there really wouldn't have been any saving Lee. We rang the bell tower so that the walkers were drawn away. And then we went back to the house. There was no downtime though, no time to rest because walkers barged in and we had a bit of a standoff until we made our way up into the attic where we were cornered up there with no escape. Now Kenny, <laughs> Kenny, I love the guy, but man, he jumps to conclusions like that because he started talking about how Lee is probably going to turn and they need to do something about him. It was a whole hilarious situation all over again. Luckily though, we managed to calm him down, talk him out of it, and he threw like a head statue or whatever, it hit the wall and they realized that it was a wall leading into the house next to them. So that was very convenient. During our escape, Kenny knocked our radio into this hole below us and Krista jumped in after it and gave us the radio back, but she wasn't able to escape the hole because it was too far down. So Kenny did probably the most selfless thing we've seen him do so far, which was jump down in after her. So far up until this point, I don't think we've seen him be that selfless and actually sacrifice himself for someone he doesn't even really know that well. I think he's starting to realize that he has to do a bit more than self-preservation at this point. There's people that he cares about and now that Lee is not gonna make it, you know, I think it kind of snapped him out of his anger a little bit. He ended up getting surrounded by walkers and we had to leave him behind without knowing whether or not he was okay. Personally, I think he's fine because if we were gonna see him die, we would see him die. It wouldn't be off camera somehow. I think he's too important of a character to the story where they would do something like that. We got separated from Krista and Omid again. And so now it was just Lee fighting to go save Clementine. You could just feel Lee's desperation to get Clem back. And it was just so heartbreaking. We made it to the Marsh house though, where Clem was being kept. We were confronted by the guy who kidnapped her. He actually owned the car all the way back in episode two of this game. He's the one who had all the supplies and the keys in the ignition. It was all his stuff. So I'm thinking that my decision not to take anything was a really good idea because who knows what would have happened if I think he would have been a lot more violent with me. It was sort of like a sit down from Telltale <laughs> through a character confronting you of all of the decisions that you made thus far. It definitely felt like that, kind of laying on the guilt for everything that I did, every bad decision that I made. I get it, game. Clem snuck out of the room she was kept in and she went behind this guy with the meat cleaver and chopped into his neck. It was crazy. Apparently I could have been the one to kill him, but she ended up being the one who shot him in the head. We covered ourselves in some walker guts to escape stealthily from the building. And on our way out, Clem saw her parents and they had both become walkers. It was absolutely heartbreaking to see her go through that. Lee ended up passing out. She managed to drag him into this warehouse area somehow. I don't know what kind of strength she's been hiding <laughs> from us, but that's impressive. I could not move my dad in that situation. But it was becoming more and more clear that Lee's time was running out. I made the decision to have her put Lee down um, and it was absolutely heartbreaking. I can't even really talk about it because I feel like I'm gonna cry again because every time I thought of Lee and still even now, I have just this pit in my stomach and like, it's just so heartbreaking. I think I can finally talk about him now, but last episode, I literally could not even say his name 
without having a full-on breakdown. Like, it was bad. I think Lee was an amazing protagonist. Just seeing him grow and protect Clem, like, like that was all that mattered to him in the end was just keeping her safe. Their bond was really something special. And I think his loss will really, really affect Clem and her, possibly like her personality because she's always been this upbeat, happy kid and losing Lee and losing her parents basically in the same hour is just, is so much for a kid to handle, a nine-year-old kid to handle. I can't even imagine how that would affect you mentally. I'm really, really gonna miss Lee in this game and I'm hmm, getting choked up. You can see my eyes are watering. <laughs> I'm still not over him and I'm not gonna be over him for a while, like a while. But yeah, I've talked for long enough. I cannot wait to get into the season and see what happens and see where Clem goes. We saw an epilogue that she made her way to this open field. I don't know where the rest of the group is, but she saw two people in the distance. I don't know if it's Krista and Omid. I don't know, but I hope so. I hope she finds some sort of safety. I'm just really nervous about what's gonna happen. So let's not waste more time. Let's get into this game and see what happens next. I feel like I look more like Rosita than Clementine. <laughs> cool. <sighs> okay, so I can't even look at Lee. Honestly, I can't even do it. I can't. Let's just do a season two. <laughs> See, I kind of look like her, right? <laughs> she has her pigtails back like that though, but I look stupid like that. So I'm gonna put them over here. Okay, I have no idea what's gonna happen. This girl is extremely strong and I'm very proud of her. And I'm scared of what's gonna happen. So, Clementine's journey continues as she learns to survive in a world gone mad. When everyone is out for themselves, who can she trust? No idea. Let's do it, though. Oh boy, season two. Let's make sure all the settings are right. Okay, I think everything's good, so... Let's get into it. Whew. Oh boy. Episode one, all that remains. House divided. Alright, you know what? Let's just do it. I don't have a striped shirt. Crap. Oh god. <laughs> no. no. Not Ben. I'm so sorry, Ben. Um, Walking Dead builds off season one. Choices and consequences the game will now automatically search your system for season one save file with completed episodes. Here. Here we go. Whew. Let's see what she's gotten herself into now. I guess she has an injured arm or something. I don't know. Previously on The Walking Dead. Oh, don't, I don't want to see this. I what don't want to see this. I'm Clementine. You've been all by yourself through this? I know who you are, and I know you're a kid. Oh, wow. The black it's lines are gone. <laughs> now. Lee, are those bad people dead? I hope you know what you're doing with her. Whoa, she looks different. I got it. Aww. Molly said Crawford is the only place left in Savannah that still has people. That means it must be where my mom and dad are. Okay, you can come, but you have to promise to stay quiet. Clementine, Clementine. Oh, no. I know how to be a dad. You know. She wouldn't be exposed to what she has been with you. Aww. Lee, I saw my parents. I don't want to watch this again. You have to shoot me, honey. Lee, no. Don't. No. Nope. You're not going to get me again. I don't. <sighs> I'm still so upset. So she's she's on a mission to find the two of them. Hopefully we find them. But it's gonna be really weird playing as Clem. Weird in a good way. Ah! 
but she doesn't know how to hunt and stuff. Like, oh, look at her. All that remains. What do you think? Oh Wait, shit! You can't be serious. We did find them, am. didn't we? We are not doing that. Oh, Why she not? did find them. Because it is them. Oh shit! Come on, Krista. What's wrong with Omid? We're not calling our baby Omid. One <gasps> of you is enough. I knew it. I knew she was Lemon pregnant. Time. A little help here. Oh no. Omid the second. No. Me Jr. No. Okay. You have to admit it has a ring to it. Yeah, the ring of an egotistical maniac. What if it's a girl? And we name her Krista. But I'm Krista. Aww. I don't want to call her Krista. That's just confusing. <laughs> so name her Genevieve. I don't care. How can you not care? Oh. You're not taking this seriously. I take everything seriously, especially little Omid's future. Keep talking, and you'll be sleeping in the rain tonight. Remember that time in Barstow? Vegas weekend. Oh, I don't like his little soul patch. <laughs> you gotta shave that, bro. Uh, get cleaned up in the girls' room, Clem. I hope the sink works in there. I wouldn't count on it. Just be careful and make sure to keep track of your things. We'll be right next door. Okay. okay. Oh, there's still blood on her hat. Oh, man. Hello? Make sure the bathroom is safe. Use left, left stick to walk in the right stick to look around. I, like... I really miss Lee, <laughs> I have to say. And I haven't even gotten into the episode yet. I'm not saying, like, I'm upset that, you know, I'm playing this, but... Just that I miss... I miss him a lot. But... It's really interesting playing as Clem. I I kind of like it. Oh, gross. She's a little badass now. Ugh, what's that? Aww. <sighs> Look how tiny she is. Good. No one's here. Guess it's safe to get cleaned up. Let's see if the sink works. The UI is a little bit different. That's interesting. This is so somber already. Better. Oh, oh shit. <gasps> Language. <laughs> Little missy. Okay, not there. Where'd it go? Here we go. We can probably drink toilet water. Ew. Who the heck are you? Oh shit. Don't steal my backpack! Not my gun! Oh no! You're not being very quiet. I oh. see you. Get out of there. You're not fooling me. Come on out now. That's my gun. It's mine now. Give it back. 
Why should I? <laughs> Get out here. Who the frick are you? You got anything on you? Come on, let's see. I ain't gonna ask again. What's your name? My name? Why do you care? I... I was just wondering. Stupid. I'm serious. What else you got? She's That's pretty it. young. Don't lie to me. I'll pop you. Give me what you got. I'm not screwing around. Come on. Please stop. Give me that hat. No. No. Where'd you get it? Why do you care? It's a I hat. A I killed someone for it. My dad gave it to me. Just give it to me. Why? No. Junk, junk, junk. Look at all this junk. Shit, shit, and more shit. Why you ain't got nothing good? Who is that? Like the last people I got. They had all kinds oh, okay. of shit. Oh, God. Don't tell me he that dies. Catch. Right away. <laughs> you ain't got nothing good. You're just a little fish. You Don't let her see you in the fish. mirror. Rush her, dude. This your daddy? What a bozo. <gasps> oh god. Are you serious right away? Oh my god. Oh my god. I didn't mean to. I didn't mean to. I didn't mean to. Uh. Holy shit. Already this is intense. Oh my god. I didn't think he'd die this early. Oh my god. Oh me. Oh me. Oh me. Can you hear me? Oh me. Holy shit. Oh my god. Oh my god. And now she has a baby without him. That was the intro. Yeah, I'm not- I'm not ready. I don't think- Holy shit. 16 months later. Oh wow. She looks older, doesn't she? I think her hair's a little longer. Oh my god, Krista, how tall she is. Talk to me. Her voice! Oh my god, her voice. Is deeper, I think. What about the baby? This will never work. Look at this. It's pathetic. The wood's too wet to burn. It's more smoke than flame. At this rate, we'll be eating this for breakfast. It's okay. I can wait. All we do is wait. And for what? You should be doing this, not me. Tending a fire so you can cook and stay warm. It's something you have to be able to do, Clementine. Otherwise... Fair enough. Should probably learn. We can't build a big fire at night. It attracts too much attention. It's too dangerous when we're out here by ourselves. We need to eat, don't we? We can't survive without food. I'm freezing. You think this is bad? Wait till we get up to Wellington. Then talk to me about cold. If we make it. 
we still have a couple hard months ahead of us. This rain will turn to sleet, then ice, then snow. It won't be easy. What happened to the baby? Um... Is it safe there? Safer than here because of the cold, or so they say. We just need to keep moving north. Okay. Did she have a miscarriage? But she was so far along in her pregnancy. Unless the baby didn't. Hi, Miss Lee. I'm sure you do. I do too. I'm fun. gonna go look for more wood. You just keep oh God. the fire lit. I don't want you to. <laughs> I don't want you to go off that far by yourself. I'm scared. It's so weird seeing her older. Aww. She kept all this stuff. I don't- no, don't let me look at that right now. I can't. I can't. Aww. What's in here? Little butterfly lighter. <laughs> Sweet. I was gonna say, I didn't realize she had that picture of Lee. I mean, I was hoping that she had something to remember him by, some sort of memento, but I'm glad she has that at least. I feel like you're not going to be able to light anything in this rain. Oh. It's interesting. There we go. Wow. Did not think that would work. But still not enough. The flames are too low. Oh, don't tell me we have to burn. Oh, don't tell me we have this to burn. burn. No, I don't want to burn either of those. Here. This might burn. I'm not destroying those drawings. Nope. Here. That's better. What was that? Oh no. Do you have Krista? Please tell me she who doesn't die. Lie to us? Who do you think you're fooling here? Give us the truth and you don't get hurt. <gasps> Fucking with me? Where's the rest of your group? I, oh I'm god. Myself. Bullshit. She's lying. Cut the shit, lady. It's it's just me. Come on, guys. She's not saying. You expect us to believe you're out here all alone? <gasps> oh shit. Run. Hey. Run. Oh my god. Oh. Shit. I wasn't just gonna leave her there. Absolutely not. Get the fuck over here. Now! Oh. Oh shit. Oh no. Come out here, girl. I'm not fucking around. Shit. Oh god. 
Oh god! I should've- ah. QTEs! Oh no! Oh my god. Walkers. Oh! Oh my god! Oh damn! <laughs> damn! She's insane! I love her! Oh god. Ooh! Yes! Oh, damn! Oh, damn! Ah! Let me go! Let me go! Let me go, you bastard! No, no, no! Oh my god, if Lee was here, this guy would be fucking brains on the ground. Oh no! Knock him into the walker! Come on! Come on! Yes! Oh god! Oh god! No! Not yes! Not yes! Oh god! Come on! Come on! Come on! Come on! Holy shit! This is so intense! Oh damn! Ah! I wasn't paying attention! Oh my god. What a little badass. Whoa. Can she swim? Can she swim? Oh my god. Oh my god. <sighs> Jesus Christ. That was insane, but awesome. I love that whole sequence. That was crazy. Oh wow. The QTEs feel a little more... Um, immersive? I guess that's the word I'm looking for? I was really thinking about that. <laughs> but holy shit. Aww. Now we're really by ourselves. Oh man. Hello? <coughs> I really want to know what happened to Chris's baby. Because she was very much pregnant. Unless they lost the baby at some point. Upstairs. Can I look at the boat? Or canoe? Oh shit. One of the dudes is out there. Oh well. Too bad for you, dude. <laughs> I gotta go. I gotta go. Should I make Clem a little more... ...nice than I made Lee? <laughs> I made Lee pretty damn nice. But I did sacrifice a few folk. <laughs> so there's that. Oh shit. Krista, are you there? Oh boy. Someone used a sign, damn. Okay, creative, I like it. Gotta have some ingenuity when it comes to these bastards. Okay, I can walk faster with R2 this time. Aww. God, she's just, like the life in her eyes is just gone and it just makes me so upset. Yeah, but no way was I about to burn that picture of Lee. Or the picture I drew of Kenny. Because if I find him, I want to give it back. Or give it to him.
I'm scared. So where did they want to go again? Wellington? Was that the name of the place? Oh, black bears, coyotes, mountain lions, poisonous snakes, and other species. Got it. Yeah, I mean, walkers aren't your only issue in places like this. Okay. I think the graphics got better a little bit. At least their facial animations look a little bit more polished, but I could be wrong. Oh man. We could follow the river, I mean, um. Hello? Oh. Stop! <laughs> Why are these birds jump scaring me, bro? I don't think so. Um. Is that a fox? Oh no. It's a doggy, Sam. It's okay, boy. It's okay. Aww. Pet dog. <laughs> um. Sam. Well, nice to meet you, Sam. <laughs> She's so grown up now. What's he doing? Looking for someone? <laughs> oh, shit. Sam! Sam! Where are you going? Wait up! Wait up, Sam. Who does Sam belong to, though, is my question. Hello? Girl, <laughs> you gotta know by now that is not a good idea. Looks pretty run over, but you never know. Ugh, same. Let's look around for some food. Aw. Looks pretty malnourished. My doggy. Good doggy. Okay. Find anything yet? <laughs> That's what I can't you find food like just like that? Can I pet you? Are we bonded yet? There you go. I'm not going to hurt you. Oh. Oh, sweet. Anything in here? <sighs> well, here we go. Ew. Oh. Oh my god. Thank you. Wow. Look, Sam, I can. Do you know how to get now it I open? Just need something to open it with. Yeah. Can of beans! Let's go! We got some fucking beans. <laughs> Looks like it's been here for a while. Yes. We could sleep in that box. Aww. It was a family. Looks like they were a happy family once. Yeah, well, we see how that turns out. <laughs> oh, hell yeah, bro. Keep that. Nothing edible. No, keep it. Keep it. <laughs> I want to keep that. Dude, if I had that, I'd be right here on this shelf. I'm not even messing around. Oh. No food here either. We have our beans. We're we're good. So I guess they went out here for a camping trip. What's the matter, Sam? Uh. Shh, we have to be quiet. What is it? Oh. 
Oh. Ooh. It's okay. He has a knife. He's dead. Kind of. Look, you can see the bite. Looks like he tried to cut it out. But that never oh. works. Ever. Aw. Was it the owner? It's okay. We're smart. He's not. We're smarter than all of them. Just like we taught her. Ugh. Anytime she mentions him, I just my heart breaks. Hey, it's okay, boy. Shh. He can't hurt us. All right, we got to put an end to it. Think he had himself tied up, or did someone force him to do this? That looks like it hurt. I bet we could open the can with that, though. Let's do it. It's gonna grab me, though. Uh. Here we go. Stand back, okay? Ooh. There we go. Ah, oh, shit. You're still going. Once more. Oh, again. Again. Oh. Is that it? See? We just have to stay out of their reach. At least she has a buddy now. My little doggy friend. Uh, I just realized that the dog's probably gonna die. <laughs> I hope not. Still pretty sharp. Okay, well, now we're getting somewhere. We sure are. Let's hope I don't cut myself by accident. Please don't be bad. Just don't hurt yourself with the knife. Those look kind of gross. <sighs> Thank God. Are they, though? <laughs> There's only enough for one. Aww. I guess you are pretty hungry, too. Come on, we gotta feed the dog. Here you A go. A little bit. Oh, shit! Hey, you don't eat it all! Oh god! Oh my god! Oh my god! What? Holy shit! Holy shit! What the hell, dog? What the hell, dog? Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Okay, was not expecting that. Okay, um... So the dog is not our friend. Holy shit. I cannot... I can't, I can't, with this game. Oh, oh, what just happened? What, he fell onto stuff? Oh my god, this is awful. Just, just, just kill it. I don't want to fucking watch that, that's awful. I'm, I'm sorry, Sam. Why would they make me watch that? Holy fuck. Ow. Okay, well now I know how she got her arm injury, I guess. Oh, 
Jesus Christ. I was not expecting that. Oh my god. I was like, cool, dog friend. And that happens? What the fuck? Oh my god. I can't. Watching animals suffer like that is just something I cannot do. I cannot watch that, so no. At least we had a little bit of beads, I guess. Oh. I'm sorry, Clem. I don't know if it's a good idea to sleep out here. Krista? Oh, shit. Shit. Oh, shit. Yeah, we gotta go. We gotta go. Oh, man. Let's go. I don't know where- I don't know where I'm going, but let's just- Can we run- walk a little faster? Oh god. How do I run? I couldn't go any faster than that. I don't know what to do! Oh. Jeez. Oh, thank you! Thank you, both of you! Oh shit. Are these the people that I'm out. Grab her. Let's go. Come on, kid. We Wait, did they shoot the dog? I don't know. It all happened so fast. I thought the dog fell onto something, but maybe they shot the dog. Oh. Well, thank you random strangers for your help. I think... I think we're safe. Who are you people? Were they- were they the ones attacking yeah. Krista? Yeah, I don't, we're good. I don't think so. Maybe they were. Hey, you I, all right? I didn't look at them fast enough. Um... I... I think so. Let's just let them carry me for now. What are you doing out here? Where are the, uh, the people you're with? There's no chance you made it this long on your own. I don't want them thinking we're doing anything but trying to help you. My friend and I got attacked. Hmm. These folks mentioned what they were after? They might have just wanted food. We were cooking some sort of weasel. They attacked you for a weasel? Damn, that is low. <laughs> they didn't mention any names, right? They weren't searching for anybody? Hmm. Why do you say that? Well, I'm Luke. And this is Pete. Hey there. Hi. I'm Clementine. It's nice to meet you, Clementine. But for now, we're gonna take you back to our group. Okay, we got a doctor with us, and you look like you could use some- Oh, shit! <laughs> what? Oh. What is it? She's- She's been bit, man. Fuck. Fuck, what? fuck, fuck. What are we gonna do here? Oh, shit. No, it was a dog. I didn't see any dog, Clementine. What? Okay, so they Come didn't on, shoot the kid. dog then. We just saw you what? with those lurkers back there. No, no, just look at it, please. <laughs> yeah, and have you sink your teeth into Pete's neck? No way. My neck? Why am I the one? Because I don't know a dog <laughs> bite from a mosquito bite from a lurker bite, man. It's not. Just look at it. I mean, it got it's gotta look different, right? All 
Come right. on. Let's see it. Whoa, 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 hey, watch yourself. Hey, don't look at me like that. You're the one that fit here, okay? <laughs> Dude, shut up. Just take her word for it. Ugh. See? Is it, uh, is it like she says? Hmm. Well, it could be a dog. Hard to say. So where'd Just... this dog go? The one that I didn't... killed it? But what, what does that matter, Pete? Seriously. I... I killed it. What? Really? A dog shows up and bites you and you just kill right. it. <laughs> I already don't I like know. this guy. It attacked me. Still, you don't you don't kill dogs. It was dying. It was literally suffering. I didn't want it to just lie there and suffer. Clementine? Yes. You telling us the truth? You look me in the eyes when you answer. Yes. All right, Clementine. That's good enough for me. Well, what else was she gonna say? I've got a good bullshit detector, Luke. That's why you can never beat me at poker. <laughs> you don't always beat me at. <laughs> All right, how can you be sure? Well, I'm sure I ain't willing to leave a little girl in the woods to die when we got a doctor with us that can make a call. We can have Carlos take a look at it first. At least this guy's nice. Nick ain't gonna like this. Not with what happened. You don't Nick. have to remind me of that, boy. Right. Sorry, sir. Is that his dad? Maybe? I don't know. They act like father and son. Except he didn't call him dad, so... <laughs> I don't know. Alrighty. Random dudes. Clementine, yeah. are you feeling alright? I'm fine. I'm just... tired. Well, you better be fine. Cause I ain't carrying you anymore with that bite on your arm. Bro, don't piss off. About... Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Jinx. <laughs> yeah. Now are you gonna carry her, jackass? Hopefully he doesn't pull a Larry on me. <laughs> or a Kenny. Oh, shit. Hi, people. She already told us that she and her friend were attacked. Then she was bitten by a dog. What? And you just believed her? You should have put her out of her misery right there. Dog bite my ass. Hey! <laughs> oh shit! Oh, she's pregnant. You're lucky my nephew can't shoot for shit. Whoa! Whoa! What the you fuck? You idiot! Every lurker for five miles probably heard You're the that. one telling me to fucking oh, shoot shit. her. Everybody just calm down for a second. Okay, well, maybe time, I shouldn't okay? have run. She tried to run, man. Well, Nick, can you really fucking blame her? Okay, now he's on my right side. What's happening? Have a look. Now, what okay. the hell is wrong with you people? Okay, she's just scared. We're all scared, Luke. Don't act like we're the ones being irrational because we don't buy this bullshit story. No way she survived out here on her own. Why are we even arguing about this? Let me take a look. Hello, creepy man. <laughs> are you a nice man? Or are you a creepy man? <laughs> I'm okay. scared. Go ahead, he's a doctor. Okay, now Luke is on my side, I guess. Hey, you know what? If he's nice to me. Oh. Damn, that must have hurt. Yeah, you think? Ouch. Hmm. Whatever it was, it got you good. Yeah. This isn't how we do things, man. When you're bit, you get put down. End of story. I'm not going through this again. No one's suggesting that. We could take her arm off. <gasps> what? Uh, I know that worked for a cousin down in Ainsworth. We could try that. No. It won't do any good. You'll just be making it worse for the girl. It's crazy. No one's going to volunteer to do that. I Sad eyes. Saving her life. Then what? How would we know it worked? <laughs> I'm on your side, kid. Please. No need for a guilt trip. <laughs> Pretty please. Who's she? Sarah. Oh, hi. I say, stay inside. Where are these people? Man, there's so many new people showing up all of a sudden. I don't mean to be any trouble. I just want to stop the bleeding and then I'll go. You'll never see me again, I promise. And where exactly would you go? Um 
to find my friend Krista. Forget it. You won't get five feet. Look, I may be in the minority here, but my gut tells me she's telling the truth. It probably is just a dog bite. Probably. Can you help so, her? That God, that looks so painful. Think? Was it a lurker? A bite like that could be anything. Only one way to find out. How? We wait. What? By tomorrow morning, just if keep the her locked up. In, like we'll know if she's gonna turn. In the meantime, we can lock her in the shed. What about my arm? It needs to get cleaned and, and stitched and bandaged. The girl is in bad shape, Carlos. If we have all that stuff inside the cabin. We could probably get by Alvin, with it. Please. No, no let him yet. talk. We can't do nothing. I'm not wasting supplies on a lurker bite. If it turns out you're telling the truth, I'll clean it and stitch it up for you in the morning. You're gonna wait but... that long? Ow. I'm sorry. It's the best we're gonna get. Finger off the trigger, son. I ain't your son. Don't be like that, man. It's all right. Boy's got his mom's temper. Come on. What, is he like... His stepdad or something? This is just a waste of time. You'll see. And when she turns, I ain't gonna be the one cleaning up the shed. Thanks, lady. <sighs> it was a dog. You'll see. I guess we'll find out in the morning. If I last that long, maybe you could go look for it? I wish I could. I really do, but it's too risky. Sorry. Oh, man. All by herself? Okay, at first I thought this Luke guy was gonna be <laughs> my new worst enemy, but he seems chill. He's like the only one being nice to her. And the older guy he was with. But... I guess it's fair, but it doesn't look this? like a human bite so at all. Dumb. Because it's safer this way. And I'd rather be sure. Yeah, safe for who? <sighs> I can't believe this. You're gonna be fine. You're gonna be fine. Oh. Is there anything I can do to make it feel better? Also, I just want to say I'm planning on finishing the whole first episode in this video, um, just to make the first episode. A little bit longer than the rest, um, but the rest I might do in two parts as well. I'm still not sure yet, um, I just want to get that out there before we keep going. Let's look in the tackle box though. Hmm. Not much left in here. I guess if I have to, I can use this for stitches. Okay. Oh. We still have our pocket knife. Okay, life preserver. Aww. She doesn't really comment on things like Lee does. <laughs> Anything we saw, he'd be like, I remember that in the third grade. Me and my... <laughs> Me and my wife used to do and he would like go on and on. But Clem's just like looks at it and she's like, okay. But, you know, I like it though. It gives, it kind of separates them as protagonists a little bit. Come on, you can reach that. Jump for it. Child. <laughs> child, child, child. Vice. She probably doesn't even know what that is. Pegboard. Oh shit. Where'd all the tools go? What? Um, I need the nail, or the- <laughs> I need the hammer for it. Here we go. Oh. Okay. Look at me being crafty. Ow. 
Ow. Oh. Poor baby. Jeez, man. Oh, careful of the glass. All right. Now we do this. That's not how you... <laughs> okay. <laughs> you could have just taken the nails out, but it's fine. Uh... Oh, shit. Wow. <laughs> okay. But these people are, are not gonna like this. But okay. We have a doctor. He's gotta have stuff for stitches. Okay, I guess we're gonna sneak there. Tina needle peroxide and some bandages. Okay! <laughs> Did they not have people on guard? There are so many people here though. Come on. Oh shit. Okay, well, I don't want to go in the door. I think it's getting worse. Oh man. Any window that's open? Okay, that's too high up. This is also too high up, but I guess I'll try it. Yeah. Could do under here. I would. Under the deck? We have our hammer, right? Yeah, we still have the hammer. There you go. Lee would be so proud. Oh, shit. Yeah, let's go. <laughs> let's go. I don't like being under here. Oh, cool. It won't take long. That's good. We need to discuss. Fine. I don't know if this is gonna work. Oh, damn it! My knife. I'm so stressed. Already made my decision. Well, Luke has more to say, I bet. Where's Sarah? He's got her book. He doesn't need to be a part of it. Sarah seems more around Clem's age, maybe a little older. Okay. We gotta hurry. we listen? Uh, do we have time for this? There's no way. She could be. We don't know. She's connected to somebody. There's no way she's out here by herself. She said she was with a friend and they got attacked. Yeah, right. Whoever she's with. They'll throw Okay, okay. I don't have time. I gotta get the stuff and maybe if I have time I'll listen in, but... I don't know, man. We gotta hurry. Here. Uh. Do you have sutures and stuff? Eh. Let me look at the desk. Oh my god. Okay. Don't know what that did. Mm 
Okay, the UI is a little more confusing in this one, I think. Duck. Oh, duck. Okay, I didn't even think of that. Okay, there's nothing in here. Shit. Here we go. Here we go. Okay, I didn't even see this area over here. Come on. Those are some creaky ass steps. Bathroom door. There should be some stuff in here, right? Okay. Hurry up. Oh, what? Is there nothing? Oh. It's clean. Okay. I'll still need some bandages and something to keep it from getting infected. Okay. All right. Uh oh. Oh shit! Hide! Hide! <laughs> Hide! Oh no. Damn it. Feeling a little sick? Just need to have this baby. <laughs> Don't look in the bathtub, please. Let it be okay and let it be his. Oh shit. Someone's a baby daddy! Oh man. That is some bad news if you don't know whose baby it is. Oh boy. Okay, thank god. Okay, now we gotta... Now that the meeting's done though, we gotta... We gotta be really careful. It's not that girl, it's Sarah. Not hiding in here, right? <laughs> Where would they keep peroxide? Aww. Wait, I shouldn't have taken that. They're gonna think I'm a little thief now. <laughs> Not exactly bandages, but they should help stop the bleeding. But you know what? I don't care at this point. <laughs> so many peroxide. Yes, I know. Okay. Let's go look in another room. I don't know if anyone just heard my stomach. <laughs> Holy shit. You thought hers was loud earlier. Yeah. Bedroom door. There's another bedroom over here. Okay. She's not in here, right? Mm -hmm. ah, Jesus! Oh my god, that scared the shit out of me. You're not supposed to be in here. I know. Hi. Can you please help me? I'm not supposed to talk to you. My dad can't know. Okay, then don't tell him. <laughs> Um. What are you reading? A book? A <laughs> book? I like books. It's called The Gurgles. It's about transdimensional body snatchers. Cool. <laughs> oh my god, Jinx. What happened to you? A dog bit me. Sounds scary. I bet it hurts. Yeah. Do you want to see it? Um. You want to see it? Um, it 
really wasn't one of them. It really wasn't. Okay. Ew, gross. I know, right? <laughs> you have to bandage it, like my dad does. Yeah, I know. Help me. I just need something to clean it with. I bet it would be with the rest of your medical supplies. Yeah, it is. Good. Thank you. Thank you. I'm Sarah. Oh. I'm Clementine. We're friends, right? We can be best friends. I haven't met another girl my age since. <laughs> I don't think they're the same age unless she's just really the tall. Girl, you know. Just... Rebecca is okay, but she's old, and that's it. And if her baby is a girl, it'll be forever before she's old enough to like be my friend. And then I'll be so cool. Yes, we are friends. Promise? It's important. Friends have to trust each other, no matter what. Do you promise or not? All right, fine. I get it. I promise. Me too. Friends. Aw, pinky swear. I hope she doesn't backstab me. Pinky swears forever. But she's willing to help me out. She's willing to help me out, though. I probably shouldn't have promised, because you never make promises in these games, because they always make you break them in some way. But, I like this girl, so... That'll work. You can't do it here, though. Someone will find you. Don't worry. I won't. Yeah. Don't worry. Thanks, Sarah. <sighs> Sorry for moving around a lot. My legs hurt okay. really bad. I better get somewhere safer to do this. Bathroom? What if we did it out in the shed? Can I go downstairs? Eh. I hate this. Please don't tell me they're in here. Exit, exit, exit! Hurry. Whew. Okay. That way we can do it in the barn and if we make any noise, we'll have a little bit of time to hide some stuff. I like that girl though. I really hope we don't break her promise or something. Because I feel like the game's gonna make me choose. And then I'll break her heart or something, because the game hates me. Okay. We gotta clean it first. Oh god, that would hurt. That would hurt so bad. This is gonna suck. Yeah. I just wish it was better. Oh, that looks bad. Clean it out. Mm, you're gonna wanna bite down on something. Yep, that's what peroxide does. It hurts like a bitch. Although alcohol would hurt, hurt okay. worse. Okay, I'm good. I'm fine. Now the fun part. I don't know what would hurt worse. Oh my god, she's become a little badass now. Oh. Nice job. Oh my god. Now, just like last time. Just how Krista showed me. Just like last time? Oh, maybe because of the baby? I don't know. I want to know what happened to that baby, man. What? Oh, we gotta hold it. Ow! Ow! Oh! God. Oh. 
Oh my god. Oh, just think about how badass you are. Don't worry. Yeah, good thing we didn't do it in the bathroom. Oh my god. She's about to pass out. God. Maybe if that doctor would have helped us out. But no, we had to do it ourselves. Holy shit. Again. Why is this game painful? I don't want this anymore. It's so bad. Is that it? <sighs> oh my god. Holy shit. Should probably clean that again. Oh man. Come on. Why do I have to watch Oh, Jesus. Oh my god, come on. I've had a I've had a hard enough day. Oh, here we go. Come on! Oh shit! Come on, break! Come on! Oh god. I should've gotten the hammer. Here we go. Grab it. Come on. Damn. Maybe this will show him how long, how she's been able to survive this long by herself. Oh man. Holy shit. What the? <sighs> how the hell did he get in here? The little girl's tough as nails. Are you all right? Shed should have been safe. I'm still not bitten. I never was. And you left me out here to die. You patched yourself up? Where'd you get that stuff? Did she steal from us? Yes. This doesn't change a thing. She hasn't done anything to us. Says the man not carrying a baby. Enough already. I did. I took stuff. And I'm sorry. I really am. And you think you can trust her? God damn it, don't even start. <laughs> Any of you would have done the same if you were half as tough as this little girl. Thank you, dude. So just save it. Thank you. Bring her in, and I'll take a look at her arm. Damn lurkers sneaking around out here. We better get inside. You hungry? Oh, man. Thanks a lot, people. <laughs> wow. She is so badass, though. I'm so proud of her. This might hurt a little. Ow. Uh, How she look? Not any more than what I just skills did. need some work, but otherwise, I say she should be fine. So it wasn't a lurker bite. If it was, the fever would have already set in, and her temperature would be through the roof. What do you think now, jerk? That guy's like a worse Kenny. I hate him. <laughs> Thinks he can rip off his look with the baseball cap? I don't think so. I wish you wouldn't have done what you did.
I was hurt, and you weren't helping. Because we considered you a threat, which you were. Bro, piss off. Maybe you still are. No, I'm not. We put you in that shed out of concern for the safety of our loved ones. And then you escaped and persuaded my daughter to steal from us. She just wanted to help. I'll give you the benefit of the doubt. But there are a few things you need to know about my daughter. Okay. She isn't like you. You may not get that initially. But once you're around her for a while, you'll understand. If she knew how bad the world is, what it's really like out there, she would cease to function. Oh. She's my little girl. She's all I have left. And I would ask that you stay away from her. She needs to grow up sometime. You do not know what she needs. Rebecca was worried you might be working with someone else. That your being here was no accident. I guess we'll find out. But one thing I know for sure. You are not to be trusted. I don't like this guy. <laughs> if, he, if he wants Stay his daughter. Away from my daughter. No. <laughs> if he wants her to survive, she has hey, to grow uh, up. Brought you some food if you're hungry. She has to know what it's like. Mm. It's just how it is now, man. But I also get wanting to shield her from. That's gonna leave one hell of a scar. What it's like out there. Better than losing it. Now you can say that again. Scars, they're way cooler than stumps. Aww. What? Nothing. I just had a friend who lost his arm once. That's all. She sounds so grown up now. What do you want? <laughs> Worse, Kenny. <laughs> Discount Kenny. <laughs> hey, look. Without the mustache. I just want to say I'm sorry for for being a dick out there. I got kind of aggro, and that was definitely not cool. Nick's been known to go off every once in a while. Don't hold it against him. Yeah, I guess we all have our moments. You definitely... You were way out of line. There. You were just protecting your friends. I get it. Well, I didn't mean to be so harsh. I just... Uh, we had a bad experience once. Hmm. Sorry about all the cuts. Um... We've all had bad experiences. God, she sounds so grown up now. Nick lost his mom. We took care of someone who got bit. It was my fault. I... It was no one's fault. We thought we could control it, but we couldn't. And then she turned, and his mom was standing right there, and she got attacked. And there was nothing we could do about it. Anyway, hopefully you understand. I do. Yeah. Yummy. So, since you're pretty much on your own, what's your plan? Uh, I want to find Krista. I'm thinking about moving on. Well, you're welcome to stay here if you want. Can you let yourself heal up? Take some time to sort things out. Do you think everyone else will be okay with it? They'll just have to deal with it. <laughs> I like this guy. I thought, I thought I wouldn't, but so, I do. What happened to your parents? If you don't mind me asking. I mean, I assume what happened to them is what happened to just about everyone's parents. Just so young. Didn't think you could have made it on your own for so long, but maybe you did. Other people took care of me, if that's what you're asking. I was just curious on how you made it this far. I just tried to stay with good people and not do anything dumb. Hey, I'm sorry. I, I shouldn't have asked. Parents went on vacation and left me with a babysitter. And they never came back. 
We went to Savannah to find them, but they were already dead. Well, I'm sorry to hear that. I don't know if I can talk about him without tearing up, but... This man found me and took care of me. We met up with other survivors and we all tried to make it. But it didn't work. His name was Lee. He taught me how to survive. He's the reason I keep my hair short. What uh, happened to him? <sighs> I ran away. I was stupid. There was a man who said he knew my parents. I thought I knew what I was doing, but I ran away. And Lee died because of it. Maybe he would have died anyways. It was my fault. I just... Sometimes people die because of me. I hate to interrupt, but I'm out there standing watch and I can't help but notice this place is lit up like a goddamn beacon in the middle of the woods. Yeah, it's time to turn in anyways. Now get your winks while you can, because we're going fishing at first light. A couple fresh brookies for dinner? Mmm, wouldn't that be nice? Okay. These people, I mean, for the most part, they seem pretty decent. Except Carlos, who hates me. I know he wants to keep his daughter, like, blissfully ignorant, but... Oh, you're still here. Oh, and this girl hates me, too, so... I really could care less about her opinion of me. I gotta be honest. I wouldn't get comfortable if I were you. Whose baby is it? <laughs> Whose baby is it? Excuse me? <laughs> if it's not Alvin's, whose is it? You shut your fucking mouth. Hmm. <laughs> I won't tell. I knew you were going to be a fucking problem. Whatever. What you came here for. Now go. Ugh, I want to sass the frick out of these people, man. Sassy Clem is funny, though. Oh my gosh. Alright, guess we're off fishing with this dude. How you holding up? I heard you got an earful from Rebecca last night. <laughs> Who else? Once she gets going, there's no bringing her back. Her bark's worse than her bite. What's her problem? Yeah, well, she's got a lot on her mind lately. Bringing a baby into a world like this. How far are these fish traps? It ain't much further. Anyone teach you how to shoot? By that I mean taught proper. Any idiot with a finger can shoot. My friend Lee taught me. That's good. It's important nowadays. I want to bring him up as often as I can because it I miss him. about your age. First time I took him hunting. Came across this beautiful 13-point buck just standing there on the ridge line. Boy takes the rifle. He lines up the shot just like I taught him. And then I hear him start whining. He turns to me and he says, I can't do it. I can't shoot it, Uncle Pete. Please don't make me shoot it. Oh, that's sad. Hey! Why didn't you wait? You want us standing around while you piss on a tree? You know where the river is, boy. <laughs> anyway, well, it is so I grab the gun out, out of his so. hand before the big buck runs off. When bang, the gun fires. Boy nearly gut shot me. And of course, the buck gets away. What are you Damn. going and telling her this shit for? Because <laughs> you almost blew her face off yesterday. Seems relevant. Trying to let her know it's nothing personal with you. Why are you <laughs> always giving me a hard time? Because you're always giving everyone else a hard time. I apologized already. She accepted. <laughs> okay, well, I didn't know that. It's fine. He apologized. 
You're always trying to embarrass me. You're doing a good enough job of that on your own. Leaving us again. I know where the fucking river is. That <laughs> God, from that angle, he looked so much like Kenny. And he's got his anger management so anyway, problems, too. I found that buck later that season. Shot it right in the neck. Brought it up to my sister's, figuring she'd want to freeze some of the meat. Nick didn't speak to me for weeks. Sometimes you gotta play a role. Even if it means people you love hate you for it. You should tell him that. Uncle Pete! Oh, shit. Okay, so it is his uncle. Nick! Jesus, Mary, and Joseph. Oh, shit. Who are these people? Who is that? Ah, uh, full of holes. Who do you think did this? Not sure yet, but it ain't your average gang of thugs. That much I know. Think about it. You're Carver, what do you do? Who's Carver? <laughs> Why are you looking at me like that? Are. Be careful. Some of them might still be moving. The look he just gave me. Oh my god. What was this, like, some sort of ambush? Can I give his what watch back? I, do? <laughs> I don't know why See I have See if you it. can find anything else. Like what? Like what might tell us who did this. You're giving me a lot of responsibility, dude. I'm like two years old. This one's shot too. Through the head? Yeah. Yep. Check the rest. And look for ammo. We're running low. Looked like an execution or something. It's a blood splatter here. Can I help? I got it. Is he going to be mad at me? I defended him. <laughs> I don't think I could handle another Kenny, who I don't even like. There are more out there. This wasn't no rinky-dink pissant match. <laughs> what was it then? Fubar. Where are you Fubar. going? We need to get the fuck out of here. How to check the rest. I feel what? like this guy's going to die. Calm down and think about it, son. Calm down? We got to get out of here now. Jesus Christ, get a hold of yourself. Nick's right. This doesn't look good. No, it don't. But one of these folks might still be alive. And they might just be inclined to tell us who did this. We mm. gotta do this now. Stay here. Keep searching these. This is a dumb idea. It is you know, kind of Nick, a dumb idea. I don't idea. like this either. But sooner or later, you're gonna have to realize a simple truth. What, that you're an asshole? That nobody in this world is ever gonna give a goddamn whether you like something or not. You gotta grow up, son. Whatever. Come on, Clem. You want to be useful? Keep a lookout on that tree line. Whoever did this might still be out there, waiting for another sucker to stumble across this mess, just like baiting a fish. I'm on it. You always so agreeable? No. Good. You'll fit right in with this <laughs> outfit. Look, just keep your head on straight. Oh, shit. Can I have a gun, though? Should have asked for a gun. You shot to pieces. Hope this isn't anyone you know. No. Good. Ouch. Damn it. More on that side. You check out these ones. See if there's anything on them that'll tell us who they were. Okay, I thought I was supposed to be watching the tree line, but that's fine. Oh. What happened to all these people? Oh shit. That's not- no, no, no. I thought it was Krista for a second. Can we just talk about how Omi died in the first five seconds of this episode? I was really not expecting that. And now we don't know where she is. And we better find out what happened to that baby, because that's concerning. Seeing as the baby- oh! Backpack. Oh shit. <laughs> oh. Hi. 
Was he one of the... What happened to you? He was one of the guys that ambushed her, right? I think. You were in the woods with Krista. Yeah. Thought I recognized the woman him. I was with. What happened to her? Please tell me. Tell me. <coughs> Please. Maybe he'll tell her? Thank you. Thank you. Now tell me. What happened? Oh shit. Feet. I'm fine. Oh, he appeared out of nothing. Just just lost my footing. Um damn it. God damn it. Oh shit, did he get Oh shit. Chop that sucker off. <laughs> Damn it. Didn't work for Lee, but maybe it'll work for you. you. We gotta get out of here. Get over here, God damn it. I'm coming. Come on. Come on. Jesus. Oh no. Save him. We gotta save him. Clem. Come on. Come on. Oh shit. Oh no, is he gonna die? Oh no! Dude, run this way into the water! What are you doing? Wait, maybe he maybe he made it. Maybe he made it. Come on. Oh shit. Is that the end of this? Oh shit! Oh no! <sighs> what are you gonna do? Oh man. Oh no, is she gonna have to do it? Someone's outside. Someone came here looking for you. A man. What? Did he say what his name was? Oh. We know damn well who it was. Is it the baby daddy? <laughs> One of the guys we were with before. Perhaps. What's he gonna do? Hmm. He seems pissed about it, so that's that's what makes me feel like they had a thing. We can't keep going. I figure we got about four, five more days to reach those mountains. We ain't here to rob nobody. Just relax and put the gun down, man. I thought you were dead. Is that who I think it is? Is that who I think it is? It could either be Kenny or Krista. I don't know. I know Kenny's not dead, man. I know he's not dead. Oh, did you try to save Krista? You and 58.7% of players stopped to help Krista. Yeah, why wouldn't I? You and 52% of players killed the dog. I didn't want the dog to suffer like that. I just... I don't know. As aggressive as it was and, how, and scary it was... It was suffering like that. It was awful to watch. I could not watch that anymore. So, yeah. Um, did you accept Nick's apology? You and 51.1% of players accepted Nick's apology. He seems like a douchebag, though. Not gonna lie. Did you give water to the dying man? 43.2% of players gave water to the dying man. I mean, why not? They had water back at the house, so. Did you save Nick or Pete? When 59.6% of players went with Pete. Yeah. I'd rather go with Pete. <laughs> I really would. He seems the nicer one of the two, and he was in trouble. So, you know. Oh, holy shit. Okay. That was the end of season two, episode one. And I'm glad I did it all in one episode, to be honest. It's, uh, it wasn't as long as the uh, other episodes were. Okay, I can't let this play either or else it's going to get copyrighted. But I really enjoyed this episode. Um, I had a lot of fun with it. Seeing Clem be a little more grown up in this part is crazy and just seeing how far she's come is enough to get me a little emotional and just hearing how old much older she sounds and more hardened to this world and 
any time that she brings up Lee or mentions him or anything, I just, I think of everything they went through and it just gets me really emotional. I'll definitely cry my eyes out if, if I think about Lee. Yeah, just seeing her be more grown up now and everything that she's gone through. I mean, this girl is tough as hell. She is super tough, not just in, you know, what she has to do to survive, but her mentality. And I really don't want her to lose that kindness that she had at the start. I, that's why I don't want her to be too cold with these people. But, you know, I want to also be really cautious and not gonna lie it's fun to sass these people sometimes especially that lady who doesn't like me i don't know i'm just like girl shut up <laughs> um it's definitely a different vibe without lee it's um it's more lonely and i just i really miss the original group that we had but i care a lot about clem and it's almost like the player is taking the responsibility of keeping her safe. We're taking that over for Lee in a way. Does that make sense? I don't know if that's corny to say, but you just feel this need to protect her and get her through everything. Um, and that's what I'm planning on doing. And I swear Kenny is not dead. I will keep believing this until like the last episode of the series. I don't know. We didn't see him die. If he's gonna die, we're gonna see it happen. So that's what I think. And I think the next episode we might see him. That's why she was like, I thought you were dead. I don't know. Either that or Krista, but I feel like it wouldn't be as big of a reveal because we know that Krista's out there somewhere. And since we didn't see her with the baby, that makes me feel like either they had a miscarriage or she lost the baby along the way. And that's absolutely terrible. And just the fact that she lost Omi right at the start of this episode, I was not expecting that to happen. But yeah, Clem is a little badass with literally stitching her own arm up like that and like attacking the dog back and like, oh my god, she's awesome. I think it's super fun to play as her. Um, it switches it up. It makes things a little more interesting. But like I keep saying before, I miss Lee. I don't know of a character in a video game where I've literally gotten choked up just thinking about them. Like not even them dying, just them. Because I'm... I just, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Next episode, I'll be in a different outfit. <laughs> I think I look kind of, kind of dorky here, but uh, I want to celebrate the new season that we're jumping into with an homage to Clementine somehow. Yeah, sorry if I seem a little more tired than normal. I've been recording a lot today and recording for like six hours straight and I need a break. I need a break. I hope everyone is enjoying so far. I'll be back with this very, very, very soon because I want to see what's going to happen next. Hope everyone is having a wonderful day. If you enjoyed, leave a like or subscribe if you're new because I'd love to have you stick around and watch me play some video games. I will see you guys in the next episode. Goodbye.